So you're thinking about running a coding club at your school. Maybe you're a teacher who already has experience coding or programming and want to share your interest and expertise with your students. Maybe you've been asked by your principal or district to increase the STEM offerings at your school, but don't know where to begin. Whatever your reasons for starting or running a coding club, a coding club is one of the most useful and engaging types of in-school or after-school activities for today's primary and secondary students. So, why coding? Why is coding so important for students to learn in today's educational environment? The first reason is that coding skills are an important part of the 21st century workforce and economy. Nearly every piece of technology around you either runs on code or was built by machines that run on code. Moreover, you could think of almost every company as an internet company, with its own website, its own technology infrastructure, its own e-commerce setup, and its own communication tools. These technology resources are designed, built, and maintained using code. Coding and software engineering jobs have some of the highest entry-level salaries of any job category. But the United States has many, many more well-paid technology jobs than qualified workers to fill them. Not every student, however, will want to become a professional coder or software engineer. While coding can also be a useful secondary skill in many other types of careers, coding and programming are excellent ways to develop logical reasoning and practical problem-solving skills. Coding often involves breaking down a complex task into simpler tasks or steps, and reasoning backward from a goal to the steps or procedures necessary to accomplish that goal. Coding is also an excellent way to teach and learn abstract reasoning and formal or mathematical modeling of complex problems. Teaching students to reason abstractly is one of the central challenges of primary and secondary education. An often overlooked aspect of coding is that coding is creative. If you have an idea for an app, a game, a tool, or a website, coding can help you bring your own creative vision into reality. For artistically inclined students, coding can be an entry point into computer-generated graphics or any number of interactive art projects. Coding gives many students newfound power to express themselves in ways that wouldn't otherwise be possible. Finally, coding can be a useful metaphor for teaching students essential skills that they will need for the rest of their education and for the rest of their lives. Coding teaches you the importance of having and making a plan, of breaking that plan into its intermediate or essential steps, and troubleshooting or debugging that plan when it doesn't go as expected. Coding helps you develop the tenacity and stick-with-itness to keep trying when the first attempt to make a working program almost inevitably fails or doesn't work out as planned. Whether you're a teacher with lots of coding and programming experience, whether you're brand new to running a coding club or to coding itself, or whether you're an administrator looking for ways to increase the STEM offerings in your school or district, this lesson will teach you what you need to know to get up and running with a new coding club for your students. We'll cover the options for different types of coding clubs, depending on your interests and those of your students. Everything from robotics to video game development, and what you hope to achieve in starting a new coding club, along with the essential tools and materials you'll need for each type of coding club. Finally, this lesson will provide you with some sample projects for each type of coding club to get your students up and running as quickly as possible, and having fun together while learning essential coding skills for the 21st century.